Good morning, guys. It's seven o'clock, and I have just woken up. I'm gonna go fresh now, and I'm gonna get cooking. Okay, so I have finished uh, brushing my teeth and now I'm just gonna do my skincare routine in the morning that I do to just hydrate myself. I'm done hydrating my face and I got a login at 930 in office so it's like 7 30 and I have two hours so I want to prepare my breakfast before that I have to work out I have to clean the entire house and then I'm gonna log into office so let me take you through all of this oh my god the kitchen is in a mess because this cupboard had a lot of red ants and we sprayed some hit yesterday so I guess it would have dried up so let's arrange these back there in the meanwhile, I'm going to boil some potatoes because today we're going to make masala dosa. I'm going to boil some aloos for the masala inside the dosa while I clean the shelf and I'm even going to make some green chutney. And the recipe for that I've already shared on my Instagram. I'll share the link in the description. While the potatoes are boiling now, I'm going to make the green chutney and I have finished cleaning the shelf. It's going to take time to dry. So I have to, we had put like a lot of haldi uh, because we had a lot of ant trouble and um, you can also put camphor if you have a lot of ants at home and it will just disappear. So now let's start making the masal dosa. First we're going to peel the aloos and chop them for the masal. First, we're going to take some oil in a saucepan, add a spoon of jeera, let it cook well. In the meanwhile, we take onions, garlic to make the gravy and we add our basic masalas. Add some curry leaves and slit chilies, let them cook really well in the oil. Our gravy is ready now, so we're going to pour in the gravy to the saucepan. Mix really well, keep the flame on a medium flame. Add water, keep adding water if you feel your gravy is too thick. Now you can add the potatoes and let them cook really well. Mix it well so that the masalas go into the potato. Add some salt finally and mix it really well. Cover it with the lid for some time like for around 5 minutes and then open the lid after 5 minutes. The potatoes would have the gravy oozing inside. Our green chutney is also ready. I am going to share the link in the description below. Idli dali dosa batter. Um, we're gonna dilute this and add salt to it. So let's get making dosas. So for that we need a little bit of oil on the saucepan. See that your saucepan is completely dry without water on it. I'm just gonna see if it's hot enough to start cooking. So you gotta put layer by layer to make that round dosa, and then. Remember to put some oil on the edges of the dosa, cover it with a lid so that it cooks. Dosa takes time to cook, so you gotta be patient. So once our dosa is ready, I am adding the masala into it and then I am gonna do the plating. Finally, I'm done with my breakfast. The masal dosa was really good and something very different because it was not the actual dosa batter that uh, is used. This is like the ready-made batter we get from outside. I got it from Reliance. I really miss my mom's dosas and coming from the south, being a Tamilian, dosa was something that was had in our house like thrice or four times a week and I really miss my mom's dosas 
so hoping to eat them soon once this lockdown gets over i'm just packing my bags and going home thank you for watching my video and if you liked it don't forget to give it a big fat thumbs up comment on it and share it with your friends and family also don't forget to subscribe to my channel until the next time i see you see you when i see you